Hello, my name is Avery Harris. Coming back with another video. As you already know, I like to do videos that show different ways to make money online. So this one will be no different. This one is called Amazon Mechanical Turk. And as it says at the bottom of the first one up here, it says Mechanical Turk is a place where you perform hits, which is human intelligent task. And their individual tasks that you will work on, you have um, requesters, which is people that have put up the task. They'll put up a certain task that they want somebody to finish. And as a worker, you'll accept the task and you'll get paid once you finish the task. So let's go ahead and just click on this right now. And as you can see right here, at the start of the homepage, um, it says Mechanical Turk is a marketplace for work. We give businesses and developers access to an on-demand scalable workforce, select to select, select from thousands of tasks and work whenever it's available. So basically, as I said, so over here on this side, you have the workers and then on this side, you have the requesters. So as you say, you make money on one side and then on the other side, people put up requests and then they get the results they want. So let's go ahead and start trying to get hits. I would like to say, though, that you also need a Amazon account. And if you don't have one, it's pretty simple to make one. Um, actually, I believe I have a video explaining how to make an Amazon account with um, Amazon Associates. So it's, it's not any harder than that one. It's pretty much the same thing, except with this one, if you already have an Amazon account, they will ask you to accept some agreement, you know, read the agreement and then accept it. And then you'll be up here. Um, before we get to the hits, I also want to just show your account. So basically, as you see, this is my dashboard, my name up here. Um, it also says approve hits, which were, I don't say the, okay. At the bottom, it say the exact amount of hits I've done. So I've done, I've submitted 13 hits August 3rd, eight hits August 1st, and none have been rejected so far. As you can see, I didn't really make any money, but it's kind of it's kind of like that. You'll see, you'll understand a little bit more when I show more of it. Okay, so as you can see, you got various things you could do, and here's the request over here. At the top, they say explain what you want they want you to do is the hit expiration day when it you know expires time's up here's the time allotted when you start it and here's the reward over here so and then how many hits available as in this is how many people can do it so as you can go down i mean obviously one pity isn't a lot but you go down you'll see a few more pennies go up six eight dollars they go up a little higher but let's just start off with this one so i can show you how this one is it says extract purchase items from shopping receipts so let's go ahead and view that hit okay so as you can see this is a preview of the hit and you have to accept the hit to complete it but basically what they want you to do is extract purchase items from the shopping receipt so you look at the shopping receipt let's go ahead and zoom in let's go down a little bit or let's go up a little bit okay so as you can see it says total right there is one cheesesteak whole which is 950 add lettuce 50 cent and then the cookie for 75 cent so you put up here a cheesesteak and then maybe i guess at the bottom you say add lettuce for extra 50 cent and then once you put fill those two up something else come at another line will come at the bottom so you can add the cookies and then you put in subtotal, the sales tax, you put in the hour it was done and you submit it. So it's not hard, but that's also why it's only one cent. Now, as you do, as you can see right here, the hit reward, you get an extra cent for the first two items. So you'll probably just make like two cent on this and then a bonus for every four items. What I didn't say also is sometimes with these receipts they'll have an example right here that you can see so you you'll know exactly what they're looking for 
Uh, so if somebody's just looking for the UPC, just put in UPC and they don't need a description of what the item is. Uh, and this one wants the item description. So you would put in mint, corp, blue. I can't, you know, there's too much stuff going on there. But you would put in what, exactly what that says right there. And we've already, let me set this. So, and... <laughs> That one says we couldn't accept that one either. Okay. Uh, what's the next one? Okay, let's see if we can accept this one. Okay, we, we accepted this one. So, we want the item description. And if it's not readable, you will put not a receipt or not readable. But since it is readable enough, and it's a gas, it's a gas station. So, let's see. It's only one thing. Chicken strips. And it's only one item, so let's go ahead and put chicken strips. We're going to do it exactly how it is on the receipt. So all capital letters. And then put a subtotal, which was six forty nine, with tax for $44, $0.44, excuse me. And as you can see, it comes down six ninety three. They don't care about the cash or the change. And we'll just hit submit. And here you go. It says your results have been submitted to Scout It, with, which is the requester, and will be proved or rejected shortly. So, that being said, all we gotta do is wait and see if somebody, if Scout It, we gotta wait and see if that requester likes what we did. And if they did, then we'll have earned another two cent. Let's go to hits. Now, those aren't the only things you can do up here. I mean, they also have surveys. So let's go ahead and check survey. As you can see, we say find your hits, find your qualifications. It says containing survey that pays at least a certain amount of money. We're going to do page the survey that does at least 50 cent. And there you go. So as you can see, a lot of these are different colors. You see this one by invitation only. It's worth two dollars, one dollar, one dollar, dollar fifty, dollar eighty cent. And as you can see, it says by invitation only. Dirty twenty to thirty minute survey on experiences in the workplace, decision making study, personality research. When you do the search bar, contain whatever. You can also say how much you want to pay the pay to be, and then you can also say hey. If this requires a master qualification and then you can also do for which you are qualified. So if you don't do for which you are qualified, you don't check it. You'll see a bunch of different ones that you can't do. So you do check it and then you'll see stuff that you actually can do. You still can't do this one because it says by invitation only. So I don't know why this guy didn't do something else. But at any rate, you got research product specific specifications so this one's 50 cent you got memory gain testing which is a dollar fifty uh what else you got you got record yourself to print pretend to talk to a close friend while sad tired depressed okay and you get 60 cent for that which is it's it's something sexual and relationship differences in emerging adulthood and is this a survey? It's a dollar and a cent penny. You will be asked questions related to sexuality and relationship measures, perceptions of adulthood, brief open-ended questions, the demographic measures. Okay. Click here to redirect to the survey. And you can read all that. I don't feel like reading all that. You get here. Direct the questionnaire will determine your eligibility for the study. And then basically, after you do the, the survey, you'll be given a code, confirmation code, as you can see right here. Please enter unique confirmation code to receive compensation. So you put in your qualification code, you hit submit, and then you just wait and see if you got approved. All right. So let's see if we want... See if they have a survey up to three dollars. Surveys for four dollars. Going down. 
right? So it's five dollars, three dollars, five, four, six twenty-five. But as you can already see, I I'm not qualified for these. Why am I not qualified for these? The hit requires that your turtle approve hit have a value that meets not less than a hundred. So basically I need to have worked on and been approved by at least a hundred hits in order to view some of these other ones. So in essence, you can make more money with these, but you'll start off very slow. So basically the more hits you put in, the more the better off you'll be as time goes so you'll probably will start wanting to do i mean i guess i can't tell you what you want to do but some of these surveys that you're automatically able to start on they will take um like 10 20 minutes and you're still only gonna get like what like a dollar two dollars at the most so it's best just to try to find something you can do easy and then go that way. Like the, for me, like for me, me doing these items from Scout It will help me get my hit value up quicker. As I said, I'll have my earnings, my earnings won't be up there, but the hits I've done and my hit total hit value will go up. So this is my hit value. We go back to hits. So once your hit value get over a certain status, like you gotta do maybe 50 and then maybe it gets to 100, then 500, then 1,000, then you'll start seeing more money. But from what's going on right now, there's other ways you can make more money. Um, to start with $20, right? Hits that require at least $20. I got a requester called SpeechPad. And it's urgent, higher pay, transcribe audio. The hour is one hour, 56 minutes. So you got to trans transcribe the entire audio. And they pay. I mean, this particular requester pays money for it, though. He says the transcribe is a full hour and 56 minutes almost 57 minutes and you do it you receive 78 dollars almost 80 dollars so that might take you who knows maybe three four it you know it depends on how well you are like if you can type fast and you can listen then it might not take you long at all and you can probably do like two of these in one day i don't know how long this person would has been up here and I don't know how long they will stay up here. But only as you can already see, only one person can only one person can take this hit. So as it also goes down, you'll see that it they vary. So person A speech pad has a few hits up here. Then they're all worth more money than uh the other ones. But you also have to take qualification tests. Right. So if you if you did sign up today and you took the qualifications test and you were able to pass all the quali <clears throat> you were able to pass all the tests because there seems to be about five of them one two three four yeah it's, it's five of them so if you pass all the qualification tests then you can just go ahead and do it but for other people that can't it will be a little harder as they will have to more than likely do the first way which is they'll have to grind to get these 50 cent quick. And you can see there's some qualifications here that I've already done. Adult content qualifications, DevOps qualification, a few other things, which is executive from talent research and all qualification values of 100, except for this last one, which is a zero. And you cannot request this qualification. I don't even know if I did the, did it yet. And you got other hit rejection rates, which aren't really qualifications. So those are all qualifications. This one ain't really for everybody because it, it will take a minute to get into it. 
like this one ain't necessarily for everybody because it will take a while before you actually see some real results out of money. Now, I've heard a few people through forums and whatnot. Some people say they only did this to get extra, you know, a couple hundred dollars if they wanted to try to save up for something. Whereas you got other people that actually quit their jobs and done this before. Like I know one person who quit their job and now they just do this full time. Um, you have some people on forums saying, okay, take, they have people on forums that will help others out as far as what to work on, what's the best hits, what's the worst hits to work on. So check out some forums for this and just figure out if this is something you really want to do. I'm going to try to give this a little more time, try to get some more hits, see if anything actually goes a little well. Like I said, some people actually quit their job and just do this all day. Some people are actually able to make $100 a day doing this. So kudos to them. Maybe I can get there. Maybe I can't. Who knows? But what I will do is keep finding more ways to make money online and share them with you. Hopefully you liked the video. And if you did, please like, subscribe, share with a friend. My name is Avery Harris. Thanks for watching.